Good morning. Welcome to the forecast discussion for Friday, July 27th, 2018. Well, it's another muggy morning out there with temperatures ranging in the mid to and times upper 70s along the coast and lower to mid 70s over the interior. But we do see some cooler air on the way as a cold front is approaching the region. And that means a threat for showers and thunderstorms for this afternoon and evening, but also the chance to clear out some of this humidity just in time for the weekend. When you take a look at the latest radar, you can see those showers and thunderstorms starting to pop up here. Now, through the morning hours and early afternoon, they'll struggle to develop, but they'll still be an isolated threat. Once this line approaches later on in the afternoon, let's say just about the start of the evening rush hour after about 5 p.m. and continuing on through the evening, these showers and thunderstorms will approach the region. Some of those thunderstorms will be severe with heavy downpours, wind gusts over 60 miles per hour, some hail and also frequent lightning. So definitely a rough go of it for the evening rush hour on the way. On the latest infrared satellite picture, you can see pretty much some clear skies. We do have some low clouds and fog that's starting to lift, but then here comes our cold front that will slowly be moving through the region tonight on through tomorrow morning. On the latest surface map, here's our stationary front that is hanging around. That's from yesterday. Here comes our cold front that's on the way. Now, this cold front, as it's pushing east, will slow down as it's losing a little bit of support. And so that's going to keep a threat for a few isolated showers in the forecast for tomorrow as well. But a slow decline in the humidity throughout the region. So let's dive into the forecast for today. Look for isolated to widely scattered showers and thunderstorms through this afternoon. By the time we get towards the rush hour time period after about 5 p.m., those showers and thunderstorms will become more widespread and some of those thunderstorms will be severe. Look for highs in the lower to mid 80s along the coast, mid to upper 80s everywhere else. It will feel more like the lower 90s with all the humidity in the atmosphere. For tonight, that cold front will move through with showers and thunderstorms and heavy downpours can be expected. The thunderstorms will be weakening but they'll still be capable of some very heavy downpours and gusty winds. So definitely use some caution there if you get caught in one of those thunderstorms. Lows are expected to be in the lower 70s. For tomorrow afternoon, the cold front will slowly push off the coast, keeping a threat for a few isolated showers in the forecast. But for the most part, it makes the sun and clouds. Look for highs in the mid 80s. On Sunday, absolutely beautiful high pressure and control with clear skies. Lows in the mid 60s, highs in the lower to mid 80s. On Monday, an area of low pressure will approach the region in the afternoon and evening hours. Look for showers becoming an increasing threat. Lows in the lower 70s, highs in the mid 80s. On Tuesday, that warm front will stall to the south of the region with periods of showers a threat. Lows in the lower 70s, highs in the mid 80s. On Wednesday, the warm front moves northward, but a cold front will be approaching from the west, so there will still be a threat for scattered showers and thunderstorms. Lows in the lower to mid 70s, highs in the mid to upper 80s, lower to mid 80s on the coast. On Thursday, that cold front will slowly move through the region, leading to a threat for scattered showers and thunderstorms. Lows in the mid 70s, highs in the lower to mid 80s. And then on Friday, that cold front fails to move through, but another one approaches with the threat for, you guessed it, scattered showers and thunderstorms. Lows in the lower to mid 70s, highs in the lower to mid 80s. That is your forecast discussion for today. I'm your meteorologist, Stephen DiMartino. I hope you have a wonderful weekend, and as always, stay safe out there.